thought. That's right. You're not Hitler. You're not a Nazi. You don't deserve to be called that and demonized. Well, I I see I I see good things about Hitler. Also, the Jew. I love everyone, and Jewish people are not going to tell me you can love, um, you know, us. And you can love what we're doing to you with the contracts. And you can love what we're, you know, what we're pushing with the pornography. But this guy that invented highways, invented the very microphone that I use as a musician, you can't say out loud that this person ever did anything good. And I'm done with that. I'm done with the classifications. Every human being has something of value that they brought to the table, especially Hitler. Oh, let's get back into it. That one. Ari Emanuel, how you like that one? Hey, Ron, you going to do anything to fix Chicago? Do I round up Jews in Nazi Germany? Do I get love then? Schwarzenegger said he loved Hitler. They gave him an award. I I'm just saying, I don't like Nazis, and I don't like what some of the mafias are doing either. I like Hitler. Um, and, and the Nazis, in my view, were thugs that shook people down to a lot of really bad things. But they did good things, too. We're going to stop dissing the Nazis all the time. Okay. Jewish media has made us feel like the Nazis and Hitler have never offered anything of value to the world. Meanwhile, there's all of these things that are happening. Planned Parenthood is new world order population eugenics that is happening to this date. I got some uh, jokes here from uh, Owen Benjamin that I want to read about Ben Shapiro. Hey, Candace Owens, unplug this robot before he runs his mouth. Um, ben Shapiro's cardio is picking up shackles. Uh, Shapiro can tell how much change is in your pocket just from hearing a jingle. Um, Shapiro is just mad that Kyrie oh, won't chance. sign his basketball. Do we get any kind of regime that's going to deliver the real Nick, change? Nick, I got a question. If I say something that's provocative towards the Mossad, is that misogynistic? Hold on, let's hear from that. <laughs> hey, yay! I'm the head of the Mossad. I'm going to kill you and take your children away from you. Thanks a lot. I don't, I don't like the word evil next to Nazis. I think we need to look at... <laughs> Oh my goodness! Just because you don't like one group doesn't mean the other. But look, I fine. love Jewish people, but I also love Nazis. <laughs> <laughs> oh man! Well, I have to disagree with that. But for the ADL, I want to say there's a lot of good Nazis that were just fighting for their country, and for them all, like George Soros, uh, for them all to get put in a box. They're all in a box. Every Nazi's bad. Well, could some of the Nazis have just been fighting for their country? Oh, they're all, oh, we can't, we can't put them all in a box. And so, I mean, I, I don't think Hitler was a good guy. There, there's a lot of things that I love about Hitler. A lot of things. Hey, uh, Netan, what did you think about that, Netan? This is insane. You are an insane person. How could you say something? It's Crazy. Uh, listen, all I'm trying to say is... Milo's Jewish. I love Milo. Yeah. And uh, you've got a little bit of the Hitler fetish going on. Germans make really good cars. I think the Japanese make better ones. Germans had a really cool leader at one time. So, yeah, after seeing all that, honestly, to say that you love Hitler, that's very un-American. I cannot, you know, abide by that, you know. Now, I, I'm not saying I dislike Kanye or anything like that, but just to say that, it's like, bro, that's very un-American to say. And I get what he's trying to, you know, say, oh, he's done this or that, and without him, we wouldn't have this or that. But you can't say, like, despite he did maybe those things and, you know, we use some of that, you know, technology nowadays or, you know, whatever you were saying, it doesn't, like, take away the fact that he was trying to commit genocide and kill off a population like that doesn't outweigh you know the bad he's done the bad he's done is always going to be you know towards that name and he's going to be forever hated especially by americans and you know it, it is what it is just like that's not something that you know we could uh take away you know it's like a like a, a predator or, you know a guy who's done you know sexual things with the child just because he, I don't know, helped some person out, gave him five bucks, or he donated charity. It doesn't take away the fact that he's a sexual predator and committed a crime. You get what I'm saying? Like, we can't dispute, you know, the bad things he's done just because he's done some good. You know, so 
that's why I have to disagree with what Kanye is saying about, you know, Hitler and Nazis and, you know, all this crap. And I, I don't know. Honestly, I don't know where he's going with this. I really don't. Like, I always assume Kanye has a plan, like he's ahead, but I honestly don't know what he's where he's going with this, honestly. Like, this is fucking odd for him to say this. And, yeah, I, I don't agree with him on that. Um, yeah, I do not like Hitler because what he did was unforgivable. You know, let's be honest now. And um, that's going to be the show, guys. Um, check it out for yourself. I'm wow! It's amazing that that uh, there's there is a lot of things in there that he does say. Watch the full video. It's on Rumble. Um, Alex Jones. Just look up Alex Jones and Kanye will pop up. It's very interesting. You know what? Maybe I'll just link the full in my description below so you guys could check it out for yourself. You know, it's like about I think it goes up to three hours around there. But, yeah, it's interesting to watch because they do mention um, some of the Balenciaga. And I'll probably clip that and we'll, you know, go over it. But it's f pretty fucking insane. I'm not going to lie. They go into more detail about them. Um, but, yeah, guys, check it out. Um, check out my video. Give me a like and subscribe. And have a good one. Remember, do something macho today. Peace.